twice in a row? Wow, my ship is losing its shit. It is actually firing on me. Is that a Taipan? Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, it is bringing all kinds of shit out. I took a, whoa, wait, uh, why did it look all polygonal in there? Cannot interact. What's going on? Am I trapped here? Am I stuck on this station forever? What the? Is my game going to load its textures anytime this year? Hey. Hmm, good need to know information there. There she is, guys. The spatula goose in all her majesty. I love the interior of the crate mark too. It's one of the reasons why it's, you know, tied for my favorite ship. I, I really can't separate this from the Asp Explorer and even the Python ant. But if I was stuck with this ship for everything forever, I'd be happy because it can do it all. You can see the coffee maker back there. Look at that. Route settings, fastest route. I'm going to go to my favorite hangout spot, guys. It's out near uh, Subaru. And by that, I mean the Pleiades Nebula. It's just this old listening post up here at hip 22460. Good place to just chill and relax for a while. Only 14 jumps away what's the worst that could possibly happen it's nine poopus it's nine poopus all right i think the system i'm going to requires a permit look at that two two four six zero system permit long time years ago i got that damn permit now i know what you're thinking guys there's a ton of thargoids and such out near the pleiades and yes and guys they're super dangerous and they'll try to kill you and yes and guys, do you only have regular weapons? You don't have anti-Thargoid or anti-Xeno weapons or Guardian tech weapons either. And yes, but Thargoids can't kill me. I'm a YouTuber. I have plot armor. I've been killing some predators and predator hunting grounds recently. I think I'm a little ready at this point to handle some aliens. Nice try. Oh, that's two misses, bitch. I made him miss six times on me. Yeah, you like that? Where are you going? We're gonna be totally safe, guys. Like I said, this is my safe space over here. This is my quiet little listening post spot. A spot out near the beautiful Pleiades that you can't even get to without a permit. Away from all the hustle and bustle. Frankly, there's a little too much hustle and bustle going on. What the hell are these guys doing? But you, uh, you're clearly a player ship. You're waiting in the queue, but it doesn't look like you're waiting in the queue. What are you doing up here like this? Also a player ship, also sitting here forever and ever. Chips are coming and going, so they're not in the queue, and their timer is going to run out, and they're going to be blasted to bits. So we'll wait until that happens, I guess. Okay, it's certainly been long enough, and they still haven't been blown up. <laughs> this guy stopped because he's also confused. Space is only so big, you know. Stop coming on and offline, burrito riot. Getting them alerts. Oh, I got rid of um, my other color scheme. I like the color scheme thing, but uh, I always liked the default. I like the burnt orange look. You can see it no matter what is around you. I can stand out with my personality. I don't need anything fancy to stand out, guys. I don't need to get tattoos, okay? Where, why, why am I making this about tattoos now? Okay, I don't need to color my hair blue. I just need to, you know, paint my ship a fluorescent red color and put unique decals on it. Why am I not rumbling that much? This feels weird. This is... Okay. I honestly didn't think... <laughs> I didn't think this was gonna happen. I got a boost off. I don't know how these events go anymore. Is it just gonna look at me? Or is it actually gonna attempt to attack me? Can you go? You're making me very uncomfortable. Please leave. Please leave. an asshole burrito riot i mean i mean interdicted by thargoids and you're over here popping on and offline okay so they don't attack you i thought the i thought someone said the thargoid 
war was heating up and so now they attack you. Apparently not in that situation. I did have one piece of guardian tech on, but apparently that wasn't enough to piss it off. I've played this game so much that I could tell something was wrong when I was jumping to the other star because the screen wasn't moving the same way in the jump animation. The ship wasn't rattling as much. I thought something was wrong. I was like, am I going to like a different kind of star? No, yeah, see, you yeah, know, I'm shaking a lot more. I was like, oh my God, am I actually jumped to a white dwarf or something? Cause this is way different than it should be. Nope, it was just a Thargoid introduction. So now I know how to tell. If your jump feels just a little too smooth and a little too quiet, you're getting Thargoid interdicted. Really again? Really? They just interdicted me. Twice in a row? These assholes! Get off of my shit! Where are you? Where are you, you little bastard? It is actually firing on me! Oh, it is bringing all kinds of shit out. Cooldown in progress, my ass. Shields, 89%, hull, 96%. I am fast, far enough away from it to where we should have decent frame charge rate here. Don't want to go to where I'm going, so now I need a pivot. Flight assist off. Flight assist on. Interdict this. That son of a bitch, they do attack you. I didn't even realize my pips were still messed up from that combat I was in earlier. Now maybe I do want to land at one of those fleet carriers. Golden Hind it is. I swear to God, that's Burrito Riot, man. Fuck. You better be able to repair my ship or I'm going to be steamed. Golden Hind. There'll be Thargoids out in this bitch. It's a lot of docking pads you got there. You mean to tell me you can repair my ship? Ship repaired. What's going on at the Golden Hind today? I'm walking on a fleet carrier. I survived a Thargoid attack. Maybe I should have brought my shard cannons after all. I definitely could have taken that single interceptor if I had my shard cannons on me. I'm certainly not particularly good at fighting Thargoids or anything, but I can 1v1 a single interceptor like that. I've done it. Let's go to the Concord. I want my own fleet carrier, but I don't want to pay the cost for it. I certainly don't want to pay the upkeep. This guy has security. This guy doesn't even look old enough to buy cigarettes. Like what the fuck what is that? Is that a Taipan? Dude. That's a Taipan. That's a fucking Taipan. I love Taipans. I have some on my ship right now. Seems a little big, but I, I mean, I guess that's how big they are. It's a Taipan, right? What else would it be? Dude, that's awesome. That increased me wanting to get a fleet carrier by about 1%. Have I told you guys I hate upkeep mechanics? I got a RP that my ship's getting repaired and I got to wait for it. You know, kind of like you're waiting at the, uh, the auto shop. Access restricted. So you can't get to the command deck unless you own the fleet carrier or he gives you access. That's cool. And what's this nonsense? What in the hell is this nonsense? This is awesome. Dude, look at this. Oh, this is fucking sick. If you guys know, can you like sit here while this thing's move, going, getting ready for one of them jumps and watch it happen? If you can, that's lit. It'll increase my desire to have a fleet carrier by another 1%. Dude. Oh, that, that must be the command deck right there, right? <laughs> <laughs> if that ain't my character right there. Uh, I've missed that face. <laughs> FDev, give me a carrier. Upkeepless carrier right now. Put it in the Witch Head Nebula somewhere. I don't care. And away hey, hey, we go. Here we enter HIP 22460, which is affected by a system-wide anomaly. This anomaly makes your ship's interface wig out quite a lot, and it slowly deteriorates Guardian technology. Um... It doesn't matter if it's active or not, it's taking damage. I'm probably gonna lose my Guardian module. It looks like it's getting fried out, but everything else is okay. Other than the, the blinking. Whoa, hey, goodbye Guardian frame shift drive booster. Rendered inoperable. Yeah, you, you don't say. Well, now it's a good thing I didn't bring shard cannons because they couldn't do jack. This thing gonna spread this, uh, this effect, this anomaly gonna spread throughout the galaxy and make all of our guardian technology be useless? Is FDev just trying to remove guardian tech from the game? Am I gonna get cancer? Why do I feel like I'm getting cancer? Oh no, my Elite Dangerous UI app is malfunctioning, guys. Wow, my ship is losing its shit. Overlook?
There's nothing here, guys. There ain't nothing even here. Got a kilometer closer. Did they drop out too soon? A Zemeth Biotech civilian cruiser? Are you charging or not charging? You, you good? The heat's not going up either. Anomaly detected. You don't fucking say. That fucking sucks. There's the civilian cruiser. Techo, please get the systems back online any year now. That'd be great. I can hear you're complaining from down here. It's attacking me. Got it. I don't care if. Incoming. Can you launch in a Taipan and take that missile? Excuse me? That missile's still coming. Is there any way to get away from it? My frame shift drive is not going. I am keeping a respectable distance from the son of a bitch. Boy, can I this thing boost forever or what? I did a damn good job on these engines, boys. It is still fucking following me, man. It is catching up. I have to be boosting or it'll catch up. All right, is there anything ahead of me? It's technically ahead of me, yes. Let's try full star jump. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, I can't do any jump. I'm stuck at slower than light speed, guys. I don't know what to do. It won't let me it won't let me jump to low wake or high wake or any kind of wake. Oh, another one. Fucking Jesus. Another one. Too fast for you sons of bitches. Oh, fuck. They just keep spawning, man. You know what's weird? There's no start menu. I can't even go to my options if I wanted to. You're gonna all coming in to try to kill me. Three more dropped in. Three got four of them. Four of them dropped in. To try to kill me. Five. Clearly, you're not supposed to live this event. Whatever this is. Six. Six of them have dropped in. They're all over. As that was that a seventh? Yield. Turn it off and back on. Trick. It's on. Now, this is weird. It doesn't ever let you jump the super cruise, despite not having any apparent problems with anything. And I don't, I can't even have access to my start menu, my pause menu, my escape menu. I don't know if this is part of the anomaly experience or if it's a, literally a bug. Not letting you access your escape menu is rather meta. It makes me feel like it's a, it's a bug. Oh, there's a lot of them back there. Very easy. Fuck ton of Thargoids. I think they literally didn't expect you to be able to survive this long or something. But it's not really that hard. I don't even have the time to to Google this because there's so many fucking Thargoids. They're constantly dropping in and surging. There's nothing. Nobody has said anything about this, what I'm in right now. Nothing I can do to either get away or stop the game otherwise. Unless I want to submit to dying to the Thargoids. But that's stupid. How would they make it so you are forced to submit? I think I'm glitched. I think I'm either A, I'm glitched, or B, FDev truly didn't expect this uh, scenario to be the way it's going down. In which case, that would, again, that would be a, a kind of type of a glitch. I do not think what I'm experiencing here is an intended gameplay mechanic of literally sitting here for hours running from the Thargoids. <laughs> I don't think that's they expect. They expect me to turn around and just let them kill me. They can suck my nuts. I don't know what white flag waving families they come from, but no, I, I'm pretty sure I'm glitched in some way. But there's no way to get out of the game unless I hard close it. I don't want to combat log even against NPCs, but there's not even NPCs on my radar. I'm just stuck. Now it won't let me even access my menu, so I have to manually hard close. There, I hard closed it. Now let's reboot it. I'm alive. I'm 100% shield and hull. I'm immediately going to try to launch into Super Cruise. Yeah, it works now. My start menu also works. Interesting. Well, as I as I said, um, those Thargoids can suck my nuts. 
I don't just roll over. So this place is a hellhole. It's an absolute hellhole. And you can't reach this thing, apparently. Get out of this shithole. Suck my nuts, Stargoids! Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, they're for sure gonna to attack too. Oh, I'm fucked. <laughs> as long as you don't take away my ability to jump and. Oh, go. Just boost, boost, boost. Would you look at that? It's this guy. <laughs> yeah, right outside my window. That's awesome. Why is he here? I don't know. Don't much like it. Let's see if he'll go away. No? Okay. All right, I'm done with this. Oh, you're not going to try to shut my ship down? Get smoked. Okay. I got away. Save me, Golden Hind. I bet you that was a glitch. I bet you that was a goddamn glitch, man. The fact that I didn't even have this screen available to me. Either that was a glitch or the game decided I was in an inescapable encounter and I was supposed to die there. But I don't believe in inescapable encounters. There's a way out of every box, to quote uh, Captain Pike. I didn't watch all that science fiction growing up to just not learn from it. All right, guys. The rebuy cost, practically nothing to me. That, uh, I don't, it's not in my character to just roll over because some scenario it's written for me to die in. I don't do that predetermined death shit.